is upon us. But I want to quote something that it says in the Gemara Megillah. Let's say you have a year that has two Adars, Adar Aleph and Adar Beis. When do you read the Megillah? So there's one opinion, that you should read the Megillah in the first of Adar, because in Mavirin al, al, al Mitzvah, so you should not pass over a Mitzvah. That first opportunity, when you're able to read the Megillah, that's when you should do it. Then the Gemara says, no. We should actually read the Megillah in the second Adar, because there's going to be a smichos, a juxtaposition, from the miracle of Purim and the miracle of Pesach. And that's actually what we follow. That if there are two Adars, read the Megillah in the second of Adar. Why is that so important? Why is it so important that Purim falls out one month before Pesach? And the answer is that Pesach is all about Nisim Giluyim, revealed, open miracles, loud miracles. We commemorate the 10 plagues and the fact that God split the sea and everything else that occurred in the revelation of, 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 of taking the Jews out of Egypt. And then you go to Purim. God's name is not mentioned once in the Megillah. God is behind the scenes, orchestrating everything. And it's the loud miracles of Pesach that give voice to quiet and subtle miracles of Purim. And when we have miraculous things happen in our life, we need to attribute them to a Kaddish Baruch of the God. But then in those quiet moments, we also need to say, that's God too. That really nature is God supernaturally. And that is the importance of having Purim go right before Pesach. Because as we're inspired by all the open miracles of Pesach, we need to go back to Purim and say, you know what? Those quiet miracles, that's also God. And in our life, even though God doesn't reveal himself and talk to us, he's behind the scenes. He's orchestrating everything. And he's guiding us to exactly the destination where we need to go. And that's the Simcha Purim. Mishnichas Adar, Marvim the Simcha. When Adar comes, we increase Simcha. Because what greater happiness can there be? To throw your head back into God's loving arms and to know that God is guiding you in the right place. Purim Sameach, everyone.